only go to St. Thomas and not say hi to the locals, the iguanas. Check them out. They're sitting nicely on the rocks. They blend beautifully. And they stop and look at you, the newcomer on the island. And they say, hello. So check this out. Check this one. This one's very interested in what's going on. And they blend so beautifully. It's like you can't even tell they're there. Oh yeah, he's there. Check this one out. Oh, there's another one right there. You see how this one blends beautifully? They all blend on their own rock. Okay, check this one out. Hello, I'm back to see you. How are you? And he's looking at me saying, yeah, just don't get closer, that's all. And we're still friends. So there's plenty of iguanas, each of them, I guess, chose their own rocks and they're busy sitting and looking at people coming. Check out this guy. This guy has the longest tail I've seen out of all of them. I mean, it's like an endless tail. He himself or she herself, not too big, but the tail is huge. So yeah, who knew? Probably the biggest attraction today in St. Thomas is actually these folks here. So, and I find them very, very cute. So, don't know about you, but I think that they're really cute to look at. This is Marguerite Frankis for Autistic Globe Trotting, admiring the iguanas in St. Thomas, Virgin Islands. <laughs> 